Hi, I'm Philip from Play Vienna um, and we're doing our game Urban Postedism here at Tokati this year, um, which is very much about uh, changing the architectural space of the public space uh, and appropriating it um, for the players through a playful interaction. Uh, it's basically you uh, have several teams and you put post-it notes in, in special public spaces and therefore you, uh, as a player, hopefully gain uh, a different perspective on that space. Um, which I think Tokati is also about. Uh, this playing in a public space uh, makes, it, uh, makes it your own, appropriates it to yourself, to your own needs. Public spaces have always been, uh, and I think Tokati is very much about that, uh, so is Play Vienna. Um, have very much been, always been about meeting other people, about um, a social movement, about communication, um, about a, a space where everyone can meet everyone. Um, and making that happen through play, I think is very important and, and a very good way to appropriate public space um, and to make it your own. Um, so yeah. I think that's, it's great that we're allowed to play uh, urban postedism here because I think it does that very much. Um, it's always in a pervasive setting and through a playful interaction just takes the public space. Uh, I think from where we were last year here at Tokati and at Play Vienna, uh, I think the movement has grown um, internationally. There are about, I don't know, 20 festivals now that use uh, playful interactions into public space uh, in some way that are using games uh, and play to uh, to make something happen in public space and they're all very communicational they are all based in communication in a very playful communication I think uh, what's interesting in Italy is that I have the feeling Italians play or like to play uh, maybe a lot more than other other people around Europe um, which I find interesting uh, because you find the good thing about Tokati is you have everyone here. You have people who are 60, uh, 60 years and above who are playing in public space. I think in Austria it would be very difficult to find those people. So, so it's great to see that here. You also have kids, obviously. You always have kids because they play naturally. Uh, but you have uh, this whole range at Tokati, which is great. It makes it a very very wide festival, a very open festival to everyone, which I think it, at Play Vienna we're still lacking. Uh, and we're trying to, to actually make that happen also, to uh, get different people from different age groups to come and play in public spaces, which I think um, sort of uh, contemporary game designers uh, like ourselves, like the Copenhagen Games Collective, they're very much trying to get people to play, but they're always trying to get the same people to play who are sort of, I don't know, mid-twenties, very cool, hip, young, uh, sporty. Uh, Tokati manages to make it a family event for everyone across, across uh, cultures, across age groups, uh, which I think is fantastic. Um, and I think it has to do with, with the community spirit of this event, even though it's very big, it has a very good community spirit um, that we're trying to build still in Vienna, this community of playful people um, and make sure that everyone knows that playing is an enjoyable activity that that's not silly in any way, it's, it's actually very very good for communication and, and for many things. Um, so yeah, I think that's great to see here.